Hi, I wanted to make some point stands so that I can save some time when I'm finishing an item. Uh, I can apply the finish first to the back or least important side of the item, place it on the point stands, and then work on the finish on the top. And the uh, back then can dry with minimal impact on the quality of the, of the finish on the back side. A real time saver. The materials are some plastic beverage caps. Might have a problem. Seem to be able to find quite a few. I've got a piece of scrap half inch plywood and some Tex sharp point lath screws are half inch long and I picked those up at Home Depot. So let's get started on the scrap plywood. Today we're going to make some painting or finishing stands, some point stands out of uh, scrap and recycled material. And we've got a fan running in the background, so pardon the background noise, but it's 90 degrees here in beautiful southwest Florida. So let's start making a piece of, take a piece of scrap, and we're going to make a centering jig for the drill press. So here we go. That should work nicely. We have a nice square corner to put our repurpose piece in. Approximately center, a little pilot hole in the lid so that we can fasten a screw to it to make a simple stand. So let's clamp that down. Yep, blew that. So here we go. Should work. Okay, there we go. Let's engage. Close. Probably close enough. Let's see if we can do a little better. Okay, let's go into production mode, get these holes drilled. FYI, the little pattern on the cap isn't necessarily centered every time, so that doesn't always give us the desired result, but we're close enough here. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. I only 
only do this once. I should have a pretty good quantity of these little babies and hopefully I don't have more to lay out than what these will take care of. Now let's take our screw, put it into the pilot hole from the bottom. The reason I chose these last screws is they have a flange washer on them already, so to help secure it to the plastic without pulling through. So we tighten it up. And there we go. So if we ever need to set a piece on it for painting, spray painting, painting, finishing, it'll we can use it on the back side of the material and it'll be barely noticeable. So here's the for example segment. I've got all of them put together. So let's say I'm finishing this piece and I want this is a good side and I'll paint it I'll finish it last this is the back side so I will I will finish it first and then I will place it on the stands now I'm free to finish the top and with practically little effect on the back side that's finished as well then we put our pieces away for the next time and you'll notice the handy storage container is a repurposed plastic deli container from the supermarket for deli meats. Thank you very much. Stay tuned for the next video. Bye.